Fly with iCats Online Aviation Training Aviators Training Logbook Module 1 Aviation Radio Telephony Lesson 2 An Introduction to RT Part 2 Topic How to Acquire RT License Points of Discussion in the Session How to Acquire RT License RTRA Exam Pattern RT Exam Application Procedures How to Acquire RT License In order to acquire this prestigious radio license, the aspirant has to successfully pass the RTRA examination. This examination is conducted by the respected Wireless Planning and Coordination Wing of Ministry of Communications and Information Technology, Government of India. On passing the exam, the successful candidates' names are listed on the WPC website with instructions to fill application and fees for issue of the license. RTRA Exam Pattern The RTRA exam is divided in two parts. Part 1 is Transmission Technique. Part 2 is Face-to-Face -face Viva, like a personal interview. Part 1 is compulsory to clear to be able to appear in part 2, often held on the same day as part 1 of the exam. Passing marks for part 1 are 50% and the exam is written come practical in nature with a time limit of 25 minutes. That's 2 5 minutes in RT, but not a second extra. RT exam application procedure. How to apply for this RT exam? Students willing to appear in the exam have to first register with an account on the official WPC website and select the tab Apply for RTRA to begin with the application process. This online process is followed by an offline process where student is required to submit hard copy of the application form to WPC regional office via speed post. Exam fee of Indian rupees 500 unless revised, should be paid during online application on a separate website named Bharat Kosh under relevant subsections. Don't forget to get acknowledgement sheet printed from WPC website and transaction number recorded from the payment gateway on Bharat Kosh as these details are important through application. To conclude this introductory section, acquiring RT license requires to first register on WPC website. Second, starting your application process on the same with upload of picture and signature. Third will be to enter all personal details as required. Then, simultaneously pay the exam fees on Bharat Kosh. Simultaneously mentioning the transaction number on online application, thus completing the online process. On successful submission of above, student will get acknowledgement page which she or he needs to get printed. This print along with application form called COP1 duly filled must be sent via speed post to regional licensing office of the current exam location at the earliest. Students get notified about exam day and time via number of notifications from WPC and a hall ticket will be issued for the same. For more details on websites and links, check description section for access. If student faces any issues, which is likely the first time, get in touch with me on flywithicats at gmail.com for personal guidance and assistance. You can also comment on the channel for this video. Just applying for exams doesn't guarantee passing and license issue. Thus. You as a student will need to be thoroughly prepared before the exam with extensive study and practice. RT exams are one of the toughest aviation exams and thorough preparation is ultimately necessary before you go for the exams. All the best!